Hi everyone and welcome to our course on using SQL change automation alongside SQL source control. In our SQL source control course we looked at how we can capture database change and add it to our source control repository and we saw how we could manually deploy those changes out but actually as our journey towards DevOps progresses, we're going to want to introduce more automation into our pipeline. Now, if you have less complex changes that you want to make, and you want to make great tracks very fast without too much effort, then we have a whole bunch of plugins that you can use to define a pipeline very quickly and very easily. If your needs progress and you want to define more complex pipelines, then we also provide you with PowerShell commandlets that you can use to write your own PowerShell scripts to handle the deployment, the testing, all of the stuff that's appropriate to your pipeline in a way that makes sense for you. So let's get started.